Hey guys, it's Juan from IDJ Now, and I'm here at the RCF booth with some really cool newer product that's coming out. I got Jim here that's going to give us some information on this new product. Jim, take it away, brother. Thanks again, Juan. So, the HDL6 line array has been one of our best-selling line array speakers for 2018. Uh, we, just, uh, we decided to improve on that and release the HDL26. Similar in a lot of ways, but also not. We've made some great improvements. Uh, it still carries over the dual six low frequency driver, has roughly the same footprint as the original HDL6, but now we've increased the size of the high frequency driver, we've increased the size of the amplifier, and we've also implemented RDNet, our proprietary network system as well. By having a larger amplifier, a larger high frequency driver, which is a three inch high frequency driver, we're also able to lower the frequency response within the box. So you have basic plug in and play uh, controls here if you wanted to bypass the network, or you could just simply push in a button, and now we, uh, we've engaged the uh, onboard RDNet control, and we could have complete monitoring and processing control of this box. Directly behind this array, we have its companion sub. This is a larger companion sub from the original HDL6. This is the HDL35 active sub. This sub will fly in line with the same fly bar of the HDL26. It's a 15 inch low frequency driver, 2200 watt peak amplifier, goes down to 40 hertz. RDNet control as well, we could tie that right in. I'm going to jump ahead, guys, and we're going to go, let's go right to the next size up here. This is also another new speaker of ours. Uh, this would be considered the pro version of the HDL10. This is a dual 8 low frequency uh, configuration with a 3 inch high frequency driver. This again is also a symmetrical design. Low weight neodymium magnets also has RDNet control on the back which could also be bypassed as well if you need to. Upgraded hardware as well. This has the compression hardware on the back here for easy deployment. Essentially, you're flying four boxes at a time instead of one box at a time uh, when you're flying. Directly behind it, we have the companion sub for the HDL28. This is the HDL36 active sub. This is also a 15-inch uh, subwoofer but with a larger amplifier than the previous. This is a 3,500 watt uh, peak amplifier, RDNet ready, will fly on the same fly bar as the HDL28. And then moving on to our third and last one for today, the HDL30. This has been out for a couple months now and it's been a huge success. That's a dual 10, four inch high frequency driver, symmetrical in design. Again, carrying a lot of the same features as the HDL28. So you're gonna have the compression hardware, you're gonna have uh, RDNet on board, bypassable if, if you need it as well. And the companion sub directly behind it. This is the HDL38. It's a high powered 18 inch low frequency driver. The companion sub for the HDL30 flies off the same fly bar as the HDL30. I appreciate all the information you gave us today. Yeah. And uh, guys, if you have any questions, leave it in the commentary below or come into the store because you know you'll see it there at our retail stores or if you're looking, order online as well. IDJNow.com. Thanks. Thank you.